Hey guys, Toby Price here. We'll, uh, we've got the Cisco trophy truck here behind us, so I thought I'd just take you through a little quick little rundown of uh, what's involved with the truck. So, starting up front, we've got the Dugan uh, eight stack, six liter, naturally aspirated V8 engine. Punches out about 580 horsepower at the wheels. So, if we move along a little bit more, we come to that connected to the Alvin six speed pointed gearbox. It is all paddle shifts. Um, basically got every single little control in there that can keep both hands on the steering wheel at all time. We run the method Beadlock 103 wheels with the Via Goodrich 40 inch tires. So they are quite a big tire. They make the bumps a little bit smaller for us. We've got the Fox uh, shocks running up front and rear. So we've got 24 inches of travel in the front. We've got about 36 inches of travel uh, suspension in the rear. And then uh, from there, we've got some rigid lights on, basically so we can um, see uh, people see us coming. Like I say, we've got paddle shift, it's all MoTeC controlled. So we've got two screens in here, one on my side, one on the passenger side with a low ramp. Then we can do all the GPS notes and everything from there. Um, I like a bit of the stacks uh, with the exhaust, so they pop out the top here of the guards. Um, and then from there, we've got uh, spare oil, uh, water, converter oil, uh, a fair tail shaft here. Uh, these are all the fire extinguishers and, like I say, box shocks. And then we've got two uh, beer food rich 40 inch tyres mounted on the method beadlock uh, 103 wheels as well. So, yeah, we've got all the spare parts we need. Hopefully, we don't need them and we go full gas down the track and uh, get back in first place. So, we'll see you guys at the finish line. We are competing in uh, class four, which is a trick truck class um, out here in the Fink Desert Race. So yeah, it should sit right here behind us and ready to go. The lead up to Fink is always quite um, strenuous. There's a lot of things going on behind the scenes that uh, not too many people get to see. So we um, we try and get people in behind the scenes with um, all the film crew and everything we have and just give them, yeah, basically the, the whole ride of what it actually kind of takes to uh, do one of these races. So. There's a lot of moving parts in this truck and we'll keep it, um, hopefully keep it at the front end of the pack. Uh, for me, what I love about Fink is uh, mainly just the atmosphere. Um, I don't know, there's just something about the red dirt and, and the people that come out here, they, they drive two and a half, three days to come and experience this race. And um, I love the competition and just the high speed that, that Fink delivers. Our racing here in Australia, compared to racing in the US or Mexico, um, we've been able to experience some races there and it is completely different. We, we are restricted on some rules and bits and pieces here in Australia, but um, it also kind of keeps it um, budget friendly for a lot of people to go racing. And Alice Springs is basically located um, in pretty much the centre of Australia. So uh, the guys see um, us on the map and we look like this tiny little island but uh, they're pretty much the same size as uh, America so if you put your finger right in the center of the states that's where we pretty much are. I, uh, I live in Gold Coast so it's about a three and a half day comfortable drive and um, nice and easy and uh, don't tear equipment up and everything so it's a uh, big big moving road show to try and get out here and uh, a lot of moving parts for it. Um, I think the toughest day of the lot, yeah, is probably the prologue uh, loop on the Saturday. So it's only eight kilometres, but um, that's the piece that's going to kind of put all your your puzzle pieces in in one piece. Piece. So it's uh, yeah, it, I, I think it's the most strenuous uh, day of the lot, and then um, hopefully, yeah, just the, the day one and two go well for you. Ah, uh, what animals better? Probably had a wombat kangaroo. I'd say kangaroo. I used to ride down the school. I used to ride down the school, so it was uh, that was my mode of transport to get to school when I was a young kid. What would I prefer? Um, yeah, I reckon I'd have to go the shrimp on the barbie. I reckon. 